This is for standardized testing for Connect. My prior knowledge of standardized testing was taking the YESCAT when I was in the third grade. I remember this test because I used to be an ESC student. Therefore, the school had to separate ESC from regular kids so that the ESC students can receive extended time for their testing. Back in the days, taking the FCAT meant that everyone that passed the test was determined to pass the grade itself. Unfortunately, I didn't pass third grade because of not passing the FCAT. If it wasn't for that, then I would have passed the grade itself because I had tremendous grades. But it's okay because not passing the FCAT made me work harder for the following year to make sure that I pass for the second time. Luckily, I did end up passing for the second time. For extend, I feel that teachers shouldn't determine if students pass or fail by taking the FCAT because if the students do a good job in the class itself and get good grades, then parents wouldn't have to worry about their child repeating the grade. Also, there would be less students nervous about taking the test if it meant that they had to pass to stay in the grade or not. I understand that the FCAT was to determine where the student is struggling, but I think that whoever is in charge of the standardized testing needs to be more flexible in the future. That way, the majority of the students will pass without getting nervous. The challenge. The question that I have about standardized testing is, when the students take a standardized test, will there be proper tutoring beforehand? And what is the reason that standardized testing is used for?